uh, when you are stating the factors affecting the performance of micro and the small enterprises it is obvious that you will going to study the relationship between the dependent and the independent variable and the conceptual framework is a diagrammatic representation or the, it is a diagrammatic ma demonstration of the relationship between dependent and the independent variables okay therefore it represents the relationship between the uh, the relationship the researcher expects to see between the variables conceptual framework can be written or visual okay uh, now it can be in terms of diagram or it can be uh, just written in narrative okay it is generally developed based on a literature review of uh, existing studies about your topic we 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 conduct a review of related literature then we identify uh, the uh, independent the dependent variable okay the appropriate dependent variable the appropriate independent variables and then um, we understand how they are related how uh, the uh, researchers uh, previous researchers um, concluded about the relationship between the dependent and independent variable then we write a literature review uh, on um, the findings and the conclusions of the previous bodies of uh, uh, you know researches uh, research and then uh, we finally uh, we finally draw a diagram so it shows um, that shows the relationship between the dependent and independent variable and we will see in our uh, particular example in our um, provided our topic factors affecting the performance of micro and small enterprise uh, what conceptual what kind of concept, conceptual framework we will have uh, we will see okay we will see uh, in our example in our example the study will grasp the factors affecting the performance of micro and uh, micro and small enterprises the performance of micro and small enterprise can be measured in terms of profitability productivity market share uh, sales volume among others as we have said and the factors that could influence uh, the performance um, include but are not limited to owners motivation uh, you know the variables that we uh, discussed above then uh, as i have said the independent variables we can categorize them into financial and non-financial ex external internal okay and uh, now you th you cannot uh, put all those lists okay on your um, uh, conceptual framework but you can just uh, create categories here uh, as you can see uh, the, here is the conceptual framework a researcher called Shimalis the uh, in 2021 used and he measured the performance of performance of micro and small enterprises in terms of uh, profitability productivity increase in market share okay and then he related he uh, tried to study what will uh, what are the, what is the, how the relationship okay how the relationship between financial factors in infrastructural factors in institutional uh, coordination factors and access to business information uh, service problems okay how just um, uh, those are the independent variables and how uh, they impact how they uh, predict or how they affect the, the dependent variable was stated therefore this is how he 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 tried to put uh, the, the conceptual the relationship between the dependent and independent variables okay in his study another another example uh, we will see is here enterprise performance a uh, performance of micro and a small enterprise was treated as a, a dependent variable and the independent variables are uh, uh, entrepreneurial competence microfinance infrastructure and entrepreneurial training um, access and uh, another new thing that I can, uh, I, um, you know, I'm gonna tell you is, uh, com you know, a mediating variable. Okay, mediating variable is a variable that explains how the dependent and dependent variables uh, relate. Okay, for example, entrepreneurial competence. 
how entrepreneurial competence um, affects enterprise performance, the performance of micro and small enterprise, given government support. In the existence of government support, in the presence of government support, how the performance of micro and small enterprise and entrepreneurial um, competence are related. In the presence of government support, how micro and small enterprise, therefore, micro and small enterprise and the performance uh, are related. Therefore, what is um, what is the role of government support as a variable here is it plays a mediating role. It explains okay, how in, in the presence of government support, how this uh, dependent independent variables and the dependent variable are related. And uh, one can have mediating variable or a moderating variable. Moderating variable, on the other hand, um, you know, capitalizes on the relationship between the dependent and independent variable and uh, uh, changes the direction and the string is of the relationship between the uh, dependent and independent variable. But the mediating role, as, uh, as we have here, government support uh, only explains how the independent and independent variable uh, are related given that mediating variable. Okay, And uh, this is how uh, you can put your conceptual framework in case you have uh, uh, the you know mediating variable okay and uh, you know i am um, once again want to reiterate that i am not um, uh, prescribing you to use just independent variables if you, if it is in your best interest then you can use those variables or you can go for uh, another variables what i'm just demonstrating here for you is example um, another way Okay, another way that uh, one can put a conceptual framework. Dependent variable, which is performance of micro and small enterprise. Independent variable, infrastructural factors, marketing factors, financial factors, managerial factors, and how they affect the uh, micro and small enterprises uh, will be stated. Okay, and uh, a researcher, Eob, in the in the laugh, uh, in 2021 i used uh, this uh, conceptual framework in his paper and i i i, I borrowed uh, this uh, from him 